Hi, this is Mustafa from Turkey again. You guys keep your seat belts fastened because this news is really gonna shock you. I think that in my preview with in my previous video you handled how to create a fake code sign stuff. Now you're gonna learn how to create an IPA file and share it with your friends and you can install it by using iTunes. Now as we know that after building our application, Xcode builds into the folder of our project called build into debug iPhone file there's a there's an app file inside this debug iPhone folder which is called application as we know that if you drag this application and drop it to the into inside of iTunes you can install it by using iTunes but as you know as you know that it's an app file and you can only install it by your own iTunes now if you click apply the settings and let the iTunes sign in your iPod while it is si signing in there's an IPA file creating background of this process now you're gonna see it open your music file iTunes iTunes media mobile applications as you see in here guys here our IPA file that we trying to create by using lots of ways but we can't here it is you found it you can you can do the same thing to your the other applications you can drag it into the iTunes and let the iTunes signing your iPod or iPhone while it is signing it's also creating an IPA file and you can find in you can find it into these folders that I showed you now here our IPA file let me transfer it to my to my iPod by using iPhone folder program by the way this Mac is a virtual actually I'm using a Windows 7 let me find this IPA but first I have to copy it to my desktop yep okay here it is my IPA file let me download it okay as you see that in an another computer which is my host computer Windows 7 you can open it by iTunes now it's opening and you can install it in another iPhone or iPod by using iTunes here it is my application you can do the same way you can follow the same way and you can install your IPA files to your iPhone's iPhone it's really easy and simple I realized that you can't find it in the in the internet I thought that I thought on it a bit and I I think that it must be a process behind this work and then I realize it iTunes is creating an IPA file inside that folders thank you for watching if you like this video guys please subscribe